Hello everyone. Um, I've just finished work, so it's three o'clock. Um, and I'm walking back to the car because my mum is driving me home. I'm having a quick tea of chicken and spaghetti and an arm bread, maybe. It might be garlic bread, not sure yet. And then I'm gonna go see six again. I'm seeing it twice. So I might double vlog actually. I might have this one and when I go with my mate on the 15th. I'm just gonna let these people pass, but no, I've got the um, the 15th and today. I'm, I agreed to go with my friend before I got this ticket, but this ticket is front row on my own. And I've never been to a show on my own before. This is the first time I'm actually going on my own. So I'm a very, very excited young girl. But no, I'll see you in a bit. Well, I am dressed and ready for six. I've got my red birthday dress on and some tights. My hair's nice, I've got my jewellery on. I was considering doing makeup and then I've decided not to because I cannot be bothered. My face already hates me from having makeup on for two weeks for Matilda, so I'm good. I'm going to live my life on my own for the first time on the front row and you're coming along with me. This is, I still cannot believe that I'm going to a musical on my own for like the first time. This is unbelievable. Right, gotta check I've got everything. Got my phone. Handbag is downstairs. I'm, ooh, that was a really bad angle. Hello. Um, handbag's downstairs. I'm gonna have my scarf as my shawl, I think, if I haven't left my scarf at work. My hair's all right, I don't really need to brush it. Just so I can like cover my shoulders for my scarf. Um, yeah, let me put you down so I can give you a full outfit view without maybe dropping the camera, that'd be a good start. Full outfit view of the dress. I got it for my, um, I got it for, to celebrate my 18th birthday. And I haven't really had an excuse to bring it out. So that's what I've done today. Sounds an excuse to get out the dress and to live my best life. So that's what I'm going to do. So let's go. I'm on the bus now, um, which is about to set off. I couldn't find the scarf, so I must have left it at work. So I borrowed my mum's jacket. So none of the colours I'm wearing really match. And then look at my nail polish colour. Definitely matches the red. Good thinking, Chloe. I just randomly painted my nails a colour and I was sick of wearing red all the time. So I went with a aqua bluey colour and forgot I was coming here in my red dress for my birthday. But yeah, so the show doesn't start till 8, the doors aren't open till 7.15, I'm going to get into York at 6.02. I'm going to be there for about an hour and a half before the doors even open, and I'm sorry, an hour and 15 roughly before the doors even open big brain thinking on my part but I like to be early so I'm gonna be early <sighs> excuse me but yeah I guess I'll see you when I'm in there gonna go and see what merch they have to buy most of it because I hardly got any merch um, when I first went so gonna stand and wait hello I'm in um, I bought my merch this is a slight problem I've spent quite a hefty sum already and I'm coming back on Saturday and I only just got my wage like two weeks ago so oh well I'm gonna go to the loo and then I'm gonna look at some of this stuff and have a look right I'm 
don't really know my parade's just gone. That's a flashback and a half to college. Um, I am really cold in this dress, so I've put on my new hoodie and there's so much more stuff that I really would like. Um, as I said, I am going again on Saturday, so I might do it then, but obviously they don't have the brochures because Becky's switching in the middle of this one so all the normal programs so I've got one by uh, Grand Opera House themselves because it is going to change soon and we're gonna have Becky we have the lovely Lessa as our um, understudy as our alternate today for Catherine Howard which I'm so excited about because I absolutely love her She's her and Grace, as I said in my last vlog, are two people that actually uh, follow me themselves. And I saw Grace perform last time I was at six, so I'm very excited to see Lessa perform today. No, I've seen them, but no. Lessa's doing uh, Catherine Howard, and then it's gonna change to Becca by Saturday. But don't worry, I have brought a pen for the queens to sign. Don't you worry, there is pens ready for them to sign because hello, this is me and I can't not have them sign my program. I mean, look at them, look at them. Target and one shot and one shot and... Okay, I'm gonna stop before I embarrass myself. Yeah. music to Regency. I'm losing, loving it. Anyway, I'm gonna open these buttons. Okay, I'm gonna stop now because I'm looking like a crazy person.
right, as you've just seen, I've just got my makeup on. I'm still torn about keeping the headband or not. I'm going to leave it on, see what other people react to it. I'm going to put all this away because my bed is a right tip. And yeah, so today is day two of going to see six. Obviously, sorry, Tuesday, which you've seen. I'm now doing it today, Saturday evening, with a friend of mine. He bought the tickets. Um, it's me, him, and I think that's it. I'm not 100% sure. But there is one thing that I do really want to buy. So I think I'm going to get it because it'll be so much easier. I do also want the brochure because they sold out of brochures when I went on Tuesday. They were getting new ones in because there's been a new cast change. But no, I think, I think we should go and get into it. I actually look really good today. As well that I wanted to say, I, as well as being this apprentice teaching assistant, now have a new job as a musical theatre teacher and I teach 3 to 6 and then 6 to 12 all on a Saturday morning and I, we, there, 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 there is words as I discovered they do books and with the 3 to 6 year olds we do books so I've been rummaging around and I found some of my old books so I found this one, this used to be my favourite book it's called Fairies and it's all just like sensory stuff so this is like soft and bumpy the wings of this one up here are like smooth these ones are crinkly you know and it's it's a sensory book but it's like a good reading book as well so i'm going to use use that with them at one point i'm going to use this one that i got signed by the author kevin i'm going to use this one silly solar systems it is a bit of a longer book but it's a good book and then when it comes to Christmas time and doing Christmas, I have this one, which is The Night Before Christmas, which looks big, but it's not. It's a board book. So it looks thick and it's not. And then this one, which is about letters to Santa and helping Santa out with the letters. I used to love this book when I was a little, little kid. But tomorrow I'm going to get all the books, all my old kids' books down from the loft to help with lesson plans i think on my first one and um, i found a book and it's called kipper's birthday and i really like it like when i'm reading it so i think i'm gonna do that one on my first day but no let's get let's get going let's go and see six that probably sounded really bad oh well <laughs> Right, okay, so I'm here at the Grand Opera House. There is the big flashy sign. I'll go across and show you it in a second. But um, once again, I am extremely early. I actually got here at 7.45 when I wanted to be here at 6.45. So, you know, super early. Walked actually into York to go and see my, fr um, to go to the toilet. My friend's not here yet. My friend's not getting here till like seven o'clock. But I can't get in until they get here because they've got the tickets. So I'm going to be stood out here freezing to death because of them. I'll go across and I'll show you the uh, the big flashy marquee, the big flashy lights. So let's go carefully cross the road. You can start to see it in the background flipping you. There it is when it wants to focus. The Grand Opera House my home <laughs> so it's always hello focus on my face that'd be great still not focusing on my face there we go so that's always exciting and nice but oh i keep hitting my chocolate buttons they're going to be absolutely smashed to bits and now i'm going to stand here and wait and freeze in the cold and I really, really want to go in and get one of the bags. But I won't be allowed in until they turn up with the tickets. And I'm really sad about it. Really sad about it. But hey ho, it is what it is. I can't wait to see my friend. Actually, I'm quite excited. We haven't seen each other since December. When we were both Christmas elves together. So I haven't seen him since being a Christmas elf. And then we like we text and we'd FaceTime right near the start of this month and then it just kind of dropped off so you know but I'm under the marquee Ooh. and I'm ready and I'm excited oh 
You can see all the other stuff it's advertising on the door there. But I'm ready and I'm excited, so let's go. I also just want to quickly point out. Sorry. I also just quickly want to point out I'm getting the world's weirdest looks because I'm here with my vlog camera. It's not like I've got my phone out or anything. It's my vlog camera. So I'm getting weird looks because I'm here with my arm out like this. Like, ha, talkie talkie to a camera. And it gets some weird looks, man. But if I want to vlog all the theatre things that I do, I'm going to have to get used to it, especially when I go to musicals con. That's going to be a whole load of content that you're going to get off me there. A whole load. I've still got to do edit my Blood Brothers one together yet. So we will wait and we will see. Going to amuse you. you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's just the beginning. I hate you, but I love you at the same time. Um, this is this is going to be my introduction to him. My, my life would be in danger if I did not go back to the south. Everybody, Jacob, Jacob, everybody. He might not be alive in the morning. Oh, no. That is a joke. If not, my life is in danger. Please send the police. <laughs> no. 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 I promise I'm actually a really nice person. I promise. Though I did just convince him to spend a bunch of money but, uh, as a uni student. So. I'm never going to financially recover from this. No, he is not. I, I was just saying I feel very 50s with this headband here. So, yeah, so we are currently sat on the floor, like no joke, we are sat on the floor, waiting to get in. <laughs> but I did buy, I did buy a bag. My bank balance is not recovering from these two trips. I've spent so much money, I literally want to cry. But I'm not going to. Instead, I am going to enjoy sex. I'm going to enjoy seeing Becca and then I'm going to stage door and eat. I will ask you about that once this camera's off because that looked like it was something that really annoyed you, Pumpkin. What? No, I was just yawning. You looked really annoyed at something that was on your phone. No, I was confused. I was, un I was trying to understand numbers. Mimi. You understand numbers? Mimi's big thing. Uh, two plus two is five, right? Yeah. Oh, God, yeah, that's what, that's what I tell the kids at work, you're fine. <laughs> No, oh, oh, I've got a story to tell you, but I'm gonna go. Bye bye. <laughs>
thank you. Please mic that way. That's fine. Woo. Okay, I'm back down. Anyway, yes, yeah, so we're here. They've currently got the safety curtain down. Which is very odd because normally normally with the safety curtain being down, they normally don't have it. They normally don't have it. Um, they normally just have a purple curtain. So I'm very confused by the safety curtain. Uh, you look great in the camera. You're doing great, darling. <laughs> I only have to assume there was some trouble on the previous night. Yeah, on this afternoon's show. That's all I'm thinking as well. Oh, they're trying to get the curtain back up because the curtain drops down on the first song. That's it. We should. You. <laughs> We're going for a theatre selfie. Me, I asked me. <laughs> okay, let's do it.
Jane Seymour said she didn't really fancy pictures so I didn't get a picture which I'm fine with but I did get an autograph and then I met a super sweet I really I want to message her find her Instagram message her and ask her if she can send me over the picture so that because she was fangirling over me because she follows me but I was fangirling over her because she's the super swing on the tour so we were just in a back and forth of fangirling over each other and it was just like this is great I honestly love this um my friend um I was sat in the row in front of them as you saw um so him and his mum had to leave before we had even got around stage door they were going to come and stage door with me and be stage geeks but they had to catch the train home because they were cutting it down to like 10 minutes to get from the theatre to the train station to catch the train so they were cutting it pretty close but yeah so I've, I've really really enjoyed tonight and there's a bunch of pictures and from the mega six of this evenings because I thought oh I know what I'll do I'll just spam the picture button while I'm recording that'll be a good idea so I've got a bunch of random pictures and I don't know how they look uh, but no I'm quite excited I've really enjoyed today I'll get home um, and maybe tomorrow maybe not who knows but I'll do a haul and a review of these two shows that I've seen so excited